So in this video, we're going to do a Boolean operation. That's all we're going to do. So to do that, we need two bodies. So we're going to create a part. I'm going to save it as a file name. And then I'm going to add a part. I'm going to add a body. Create a sketch. And I'm going to create something on the XY plane. And I always look down here because if that's in too small, you're going to make little tiny parts. So you're aware. I'm just going to literally do a rectangle. I'm not constraining it for any reason. I'm just going to create a body. That's all I want. Now, I need to create a second body because a Boolean is an operation between two bodies. So I'll make sure my part is active and I create a new body. And now I'm going to create a sketch inside that body. This time I'm going to do it in this plane. And I'm just going to create a circular part just so you can see the difference. And then I'm going to pad that body. So now I have two bodies and they are separate from each other. They're inside one part, but they are two separate bodies. And I can turn one off by hitting the space bar. Hit space bar, turn it back on, select that one, space bar, space bar. Now to the Boolean operation. So remember, I'm in part design when I created these two parts. And I'm going to hit the Boolean operation. And let me just go back a minute. I've selected this body, then I hit the Boolean operation. So that body disappeared because you can't do a Boolean operation to itself. So I only have two bodies, so I'm going to add the second body. And now, by default, the Boolean operation is going to fuse, which means stick them together so they'll become one body. So if I say OK, I now have a body. And it's just that one body. Now, if I want to change that, I can go back inside this body to the Boolean operation and change it from a fuse to a cut. And what it does, it takes that first body that I selected and it cuts the second body out of it. So that's the slot that it would make if you cut the first body with the second body. And again, it's just one body. The other body is gone. It's actually cut in that part. So if I want to change that again, I go back into the Boolean operation. This time I'm going to make it a common. Now the common is the opposite to the to that slot that we cut out. It's the pieces where the two bodies intersect. And that's all that gets left. So the most usual is to do a fuse or a cut. But the common can be quite a powerful Boolean operation. So now you've seen the basic Boolean operations. Very simple. Just remember that you have to have two part, two bodies to start with. Inside one part is fine. Um, so you're going to have two bodies. And then you create the Boolean operation is between those two bodies. So. That's the way to remember it. Okay, if you're enjoying this quick series, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Give this video a thumbs up. I would appreciate it. And I will see you in the next one.